How's it going everybody? My name is Adam here. Thanks for clicking on this video and taking some time out of your day to check it out. So we're going to get right into the nitty gritty right here. It's starting to sell on eBay. It's been a while since I've tried to sell anything on eBay and I figure I have some stuff kicking around that I'm going to chuck on. And uh, if you're interested, this isn't going to be really a how-to video, but it's just going to be a rundown of what I'm doing, what I'm selling, and uh, maybe it'll give you some motivation to start up your own store. All right, let's go check over what I have on the go here for my setup. How I'm taking my photos, what I'm planning on selling right now that I have just kicking around the house. All right, well, here it is. My super, super simple setup that I'm using right now to take some photos of some smaller items. So right there, this is just literally a clothing rack. Took the top off of it and I strung my lights down from it. It's just an old shop light that I was using and used some water there that I just tied it off. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much just super, super simple little turntable here where I can put some items on and turn them for uh, videos and it's just literally a box with a stand with what I'm using for some of the stuff that I'm selling right now got my computer right there and yeah it's just super super simple setup you don't need very much to get going you could even go simpler than this but like I say this is just stuff that I had kicking around that I figure I can use to uh, to enhance the photos and videos that I'm going to be using so I've only ever sold a couple times on eBay before this, nothing really where I had a serious goal in mind. So like I say, this is going to be a 30 day challenge to myself to, uh, to see what I can do. And you may be asking, well, okay, so what can I start selling? What do I have kicking around the house that I can use and uh, maybe potentially start making a profit from it? So uh, I know that Pokemon cards are popping off right now and it just so happened that when I was younger I did collect some Pokemon cards. So I have some kicking around here and that's what I'm using right now in my box set up here that you just seen is uh, I have a Pokemon card set up right here and I'll just show you what it all looks like with the stand and the card and everything on it and you can use anything that fits inside of it or you could potentially set up something else for bigger items as well just to showcase your, your awesome pictures that you're going to take. Alright there we go. Got one card set up on the stand, looking absolutely all lit up here, just fantastic. Shop light doing its job, and I have a white background on there to make everything kind of pop, make it all look clean. And that's what the card looks like when I'm going to be taking pictures of it from all different angles. Super, super easy. Super, super easy setup. Literally used just a box kicking around with some white plain paper taped on the back of it. Like I said earlier, a shop light, clothes rack, and Bob's your uncle as they say. Alright, you've seen the setup there, and uh, this card I haven't taken any pictures of yet, so I'll, uh, I'll get my other camera set out, because this is the one that I used to take the photos. But I'll set up the GoPro, and uh, I'm just going to take some photos. And I have some other cards over here and some other stuff in mind that I have uh, that I want to take some photos of that I want to get listed on there today as well. So we're going to get right at it. I'll set this bad boy down, get my other camera set up, and we'll keep on going in this, uh, this first timer's eBay selling. Before I get too carried away, I have probably 10 or 11 items and I believe I have right around 10 pictures for each just to kind of increase the visibility of each item. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to jump on the computer and I'm going to get some of the items listed and once I get those 10 or 11 items listed I can start finding some more, keep on the process on the go, photos and uploads and all that good stuff. So this is going to be a 30 day process, 30 day trial period I guess and we're going to see how much I can make here off of uh, just some things that I have kicking around and if I decide to go out then pick up some more stuff from the thrift store or whatever but it's gonna be a 30-day challenge to see how much uh, potential earnings that I could get here off first time selling on eBay all right we're back here on the computer and look at that we have first active listing there it is right there there's our first active listing right there so we'll go down we'll click on her and what is it it's a listed Gyarados Pokemon card. There's one of the photos from earlier. Came out really, really good. So 
So there it is. First listing, Gyarados. This was just the automatic uh, setting that I put it on for the price, 2180, so I just figured I'd just leave it. And uh, on to the next one. All right, we're making some great headway. Just been working on this all day and I'm just looking down at my eBay store right now and I believe I have 14 things listed up right now. And uh, we're already as it is, I have some messages rolling in about some Pokemon cards that I have up for sale. So hey, with even in the first couple hours, I might have a couple sales already. Uh, I'll turn it around and I'll show you what it's looking like so far. Well, there we are. We have 14 things listed up so far. Let's just click on that. And we'll come zoom out. So here's everything that I have listed so far. All right, well, there we have it. There's a couple things that I have for sale, 14 items all together, and I have a couple more here that I'm gonna list as we speak. Stick around because right after this I'm going to show you a little tip and trick to make things easier when you're out and about. If you want to know a price of something that you have in your hand in a shop, it'll bring you right up to the eBay thing and it'll tell you the price of what it's selling for online. Alright, so I have this. Uh, it's brand new. It's to cut your own hair and it's an even cut. So I'm going to come over to my phone here and it's uh, this barcode scanner. So we're going to click that and we're going to click down here in this corner the camera and that will open her up. And then we're going to find the barcode and as you see it brings up everything right here of what it's selling for super super easy super easy so that's just a little helpful tip when you're out and about if you want uh, to find out some products and what they're selling on online